The state of Wisconsin has set two records today, the number of new cases and deaths. Health officials confirmed 63 deaths in the past 24 hours. Now, COVID-19 isn't just a risk in highly populated areas. Health officials are urging everyone to take precautions, even in small towns. It comes as the proportion of cases in Dane County outside Madison increases. Madeline, Madeline O'Neill, live at the Alliant Energy Center to explain what data experts are seeing. Maddie? Well, as cases rise, we saw more than a three hour wait for those hoping to get tested here at the Alliant Energy Center all afternoon today. Public Health Madison and Dane County, which runs the testing, says that a geographic shift with cases we're seeing nationwide to rural areas is being reflected gradually here in Dane County as well. We keep breaking our testing records. Four Tuesdays in a row, the Alliant Energy Center testing site has been packed with long lines in Madison. When you have generally higher rates um, in the community, you're likely to see greater transmission levels everywhere in every town and every sector. October numbers from Public Health Madison and Dane County show of those in the county who end up with a positive result. Nearly 60% are from outside the city, fairly evenly spread across the map, according to COVID response data team lead Katarina Grande. Not confined to just the suburbs of Madison, but it's also reaching pretty rural areas of Dane County as well. Last month, 28% of positive Dane County cases came from outside Madison, back when cases on campus spiked. Then after that, uh, the pattern is moving gradually outside. Outside to suburbs and cities like Wanakee, according to UW-Madison Geography PhD student Atlas Guo. We spoke with Guo about his data dashboard in September. Since then, he's made this visual to show the spread outside city limits. It also reminds us even in the, I mean, the areas with the relatively lower population, there are still high uh, possibility uh, of getting yeah, infected. And a reminder to take precautions wherever you are. Wear your mask, even in small towns, um, avoid big groups, avoid events like weddings or parties, as hard as that is, staying six feet away from others. Before September, health officials say there was a more even 50-50 split between Dane County cases in Madison and outside Madison. Now, Guo has also made a state map showing COVID cases here in Wisconsin, noting that here in Dane County, we're better off than a lot of areas, including northeast Wisconsin and especially the Green Bay area.